Hi guys, I'm Archie Manners, Master of Ceremonies here at the Royal World, just putting the finishing touches on the arrangements for the most regal of summers. I'm here to give you an exclusive behind the scenes preview of the house where our royal guests will be staying. They've already moved in, but they've just nipped off for the day, so we're able to show you behind the scenes. This is the swimming pool area where they can top up their tan, something royals are very easy and familiar with. To be honest, they spend most of their summer on holiday anyway. And up here it really hots up, literally. A jacuzzi perfect for a right royal romp. And behind me, a bar, perfect for a restorative glass of champagne, having done absolutely nothing. Let's head inside. And this is the hallway, the first place our royals see when they come into the house. We put some globes out to remind them of what a globe-trotting bunch they are, and a waiting area. Royals are very familiar with waiting, usually for a parent to die. And up here, a stag. Fairly peculiar looking, I know, it was shot only two weeks ago. Let's go through to the living space. Welcome to the hub of the house, where our young royals will be fighting, crying, loving and laughing. This is the dining area where they'll share stories and gossip of royal connections and families. Up here is the kitchen area where the royals will be doing their washing up. Who'd have thunk it? Royals washing up, it's great. Through here is the seating area where they can swap stories and gossip and bicker and bark amongst this beautiful artwork, including, of course, Her Majesty the Queen, to remind all our royals that they're not top dog. Come through to the orangery. Kind of an indoor greenhouse where our cast will be expected to keep these beautiful plants alive. We also keep all that's needed for the high octane, adrenaline fueling sports we have, like um, croquet. And out of the orangery and into the garden, the most fabulous British summer, full of fun games. Woo! And here is our beautifully manicured lawn where our royals will spend luxurious afternoons playing croquet, barbecuing, oh, and it's also a helipad, obviously. Let's show you into the first bedroom. This is where some of our ladies will be sleeping in here. They're quite tidy, these ones. I can't tell you who they are. Duck down duvet, lap of luxury, but they are sharing rooms. Let's see how that goes down with our royals. Come through to the makeup room. This is where they get ready before the night's out. Endless hat boxes. It's like the mad hatters in here. Um, sort of what look like paint brushes so they can paint themselves and make themselves look utterly gorgeous. So let's go through to the boys' room. Back past where the ladies pamper themselves through the grand staircase. And here, the first of the boys' rooms. As you can see, very messy. And it's got the air of, um, well, privilege, frankly. And through here, the bathroom. Well, that's got a slight scent of something completely different. Thank God YouTube and online doesn't do smells, otherwise you'd be passing out. Well, that finishes our tour of this magnificent residence where our young royals will be spending the summer of a lifetime. There'll be tantrums and tiaras, princes and prima donnas. Wish us luck.